Hello dear students, hope you are doing well. This is our 8th week and in this week we will do our 7th experiment. In this experiment we will display our desired number or alphabet using 7 segment display. The required components are Arduino UNO, common cathode 7 segment display, resistor and ground terminal. Here we present the working procedure of our experiment. Uh, first, draw the circuit and take Arduino UNO. Then we add uh, 7 resistors uh, and a 7 segment common cathode. And lastly, a ground terminal. And after, after that, we will connect all of the components. Uh, then after simulating, um, then after writing code and simulating um, the circuit the output will be appeared here seven segment display is a form of electronic display device for display in displaying decimal or hexadecimal numericals that is an alternative to the more complex dot matrix displays uh, it consists of seven leds uh, arranged in a rectangular fashion each of these seven leds is called a seven segment because when uh, illuminated, the seven segment forms a part of a numerical digit. Uh, the numerical digit both can be both decimal or hexadecimal. Uh, individual segments are coded here randomly. Uh, there are therefore two types of LED seven segment displays. Uh, these can be called common cathode and common anode from which we have chosen common cathode type. Seven segment displays are widely used in digital clocks, electronic meters, basic calculators and other electronic devices that display numerical information. First, we will draw the circuit in Proteus software. For that, first take, an, take, first take uh, a Arduino UNO um, an Arduino UNO, then take a um, seven segment common cathode, and after that, we will take uh, seven 300 ohm resistors. Seven resistors are needed because seven segment display has seven pins, and we will connect seven um, all of the pins. Then we will connect them using wires. Uh, the and the pin at the lower part of seven segment display will be connected with the ground terminal. Uh, now the circuit design is done. I have used the pin numbers 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8 of the Arduino UNO for connecting the seven segments. We uh, must remember the pin numbers uh, to give them in code. Uh, now come to the log uh, come to write the logical codes in Arduino software. I have not used any for loop or any if else condition. Uh, just written the pin numbers instead of um, instead to make the course more simple, but it has become long. In void setup part, is pin numbers are sent to the output using pin mode function. Then in void setup part, I have written code for display 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Uh, these numbers with uh, is after um, after is that is uh, 500 millisecond delay. For displaying is number the 7 segment pin configurations should be known. Depending on that I have set high or low voltage for the Arduino pin, num pin number. This screenshot shows the hex file location after compiling the code. Uh, we will copy the location and paste it in the program file box of the Arduino UNO. Now it's time to come to the Proteus software to simulate the circuit. After simulating the numbers from 0 to 5, that is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, is displayed one after another, having a half second of delay uh, in between is 
we can get any number or alphabet by editing the code um, code in idle and the output will be appeared in proteus thank you